So today is August 31st and we have a special delivery coming in from Grimshaw Trucking. It's a great big pallet of books from Friesen's Corporation Printing Press, one of top North America's top printing presses. And it has 704 pounds worth of cargo, 22 pieces on the pallet and we're gonna find out what's inside. Are you excited? Yes! <laughs> Yay! Do, 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 do. Oh. Hi! Hello! This is a big box. Yay! Celebration! Celebrate! Celebrate! Book is in. We are here to celebrate with bubbles! With bubbles. With bubbles. To you. Oh wow. <laughs> so let's take a look at this. We have so Four some... Seasons North Publishing. Wow. Title Through These Dark Gates. Soft cover. Soft cover. Soft cover. And we've got our hard cover. Okay. This is so cool. This project has been eight years in the making. We are all excited to open Brooklyn's yes. books and see what they look like. So today we have order number 290563 through these dark gates. We have 350 plus softcover books and 100 hardcover books over that. And we're going to open up these boxes and check to see what we got inside. Here's Oh wow. Okay, you're gonna wanna look at this. I can't see you here. Wow. Okay. Go. Pull the cover away. Oh my. Pull it away. Oh, oh my. Wow. Ooh, the lolly. That looks really beautiful. Oh. Wow, your wow. first book. That looks amazing. Hardcover. Congratulations, oh, bro. There's your Look at this. Everybody. Your first <laughs> copy. Wow. Through these dark gates. Huh? Wow, I've seen it so many times. It's so, so beautiful. Screen. That looks amazing. Wow. Wow. That is really Open. Cool. Open it up. Oh, it looks so legit. It is oh, legit. It's beautiful. That's damaging for a guy like me. It's this is my dirty fingernails. <laughs> wow. Look at this. Yeah. I love the water so at the back. You want to I like the type of paper. I love the water. I, I like the paper. I'm excited. The paper's kind of stuck on the light box. I want to take a look through this. Okay, so we've got our first, um, first page here. Through these dark gates, oh. and this is Alberta, Canada, Four Seasons North Publishing. And we got our copyright page here, printed and bound in Canada by Friesen's Corporation. Uh, Friesen's Corporation is amazing. Um, their sales representative, um, who I worked with, I want to thank Friesen Corporation, Altona, Manitoba. They're one of North America's top printing presses. Um, so I had amazing sales uh, representative Donovan Bergman and my project manager, uh, book specialist, Melissa Giesbrick. And then, of course, I had my um, incredible cover designer, Dean Pickup from Canada Book Design. My cover photography by, None guess other than who, me. Amberlynn Beagle. <laughs> and we have and Brooke, um, back, Elise Schweitzer for the C background. Um, and okay, who else do we need to this. specify? Just hold it still, it just um, looks so good. Costumes by Narrow Way Productions, as you see, the costumes. Of course, my amazing editor, Tannis Nessler of Revision Editing, and uh, mentor and researcher, Susan Rabby Dunn. We have the dedication page to Dad and Mum, who first taught me the fear of Yahweh. And then we have. Here, yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Psalms 23, 4. Then we have the author notes. This is amazing. I've only seen these pages on a flat computer screen, so to actually see it in 3D, real life, is very amazing. It's surreal. I don't, it, it's, yeah. I haven't actually touched it yet. 
It's beautiful. It is. It's so cool. The, the feel of it is amazing. How many pages? It's 408 pages. And how many words? Just over 132,000 words. And we have the, both the author in the back and a selected bibliography. Wow. Um, so yeah. What does everybody think? Beautiful. It's very beautiful. It's so beautiful. beautiful. I'm sold over covers. here. Yep. Robert, maybe the first one. Oh, awesome. No, actually. Nope. Oh, no, okay. I have a bunch of pre-orders, <laughs> but you're oh, the first person in real life to buy there one. There you go. Yes. Yeah. To walk so, in yeah, so. Mr. Boss, Boss <laughs> yeah, exactly. Mr. Boss Mr. just bought the first book live. Can I really enjoy live it? Live on it site. It's absolutely okay. wonderful. Pick your glasses. It'll there. be a good read. <laughs> Behind the scenes, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> so my very first sales came from my dad. Very special. He wanted to buy the very first copy. And after that, we had Peter, who gave uh, unexpected $100 for one hardcover. Thank you, Peter. <laughs> wow. And then we had Sydney. Uh, then we had Marie, Susan, Sean, Mary Kay, Sydney, Bailey, Luke, Linda and Sabine and Suzanne. Thank you to my very first buyers of the book. Thank you so much. It uh, takes an incredible amount of funds and time to get a book published and this is the first time. So for you to invest in this book and support me that way is extremely appreciated. So thank you. This is a historical novel. A fiction, Christian, historical, um, religious so um, I recommend that readers be either 15 or 16 years of age based on the mature thematic material that's in the story <laughs> the boys are fleeing bye Simon bye. I think they're gonna go fencing all right here we unbox the soft cover girls This will be interesting. Here we go. Wow. Ooh, these look good. The hardcover is amazing. These are beautiful too, though. Wow. wow. Feel of the soft hey, this looks good. Wow. I really like this. Wow, one. look at that. The soft cover feels great. Nice. It feels more like you're sitting. You're it's like a little more. Couch. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Holding a couch. Holding a couch. That is comfortable. It is. That's very comfortable. Okay, so here we so go. You can really bend things over. It's our first so page. Yeah. Nice. So this book has been eight years in the making. I've been in the trenches of research, writing, editing, and finally cover and interior design with my amazing book production team, which includes Tannis Nessler of Revision Editing and Susan Rabby Dunn. Um, and then we have my amazing book cover designer, Dean Pickup of Canada Book Designs. And I'm so grateful that all of these professionals were right here from Alberta. And I was incredibly blessed to be able to find them. I definitely feel like it was an answer to prayer in finding you, Tannis, Susan, and Dean. So thank you so much for all of your hard work. And then of course we have Friesen's Corporation Printing Press, one of North America's top printing presses who I worked with for this first book run. It's kind of sticking your neck out when you do a print run like this, but since we have Four Seasons North and all of our YouTube subscribers, which I'm, I'm counting on you to buy these books, <laughs> and uh, thankfully we have this outlet, this, these online platforms, which has been a huge blessing. And I thank my sister Amberlynn, who is especially talented with the, our videography and all of the advertising on our fourseasonsnorth.com website and of course all of the rest of my family who has undergirded me throughout this project and all my other mentors and proofreaders you know who you are thank you so much for all of the help um, and your friendship through these long years sometimes dark but now bright and sunny and exciting just a few more things tons and tons and tons of research went into this and only a small amount was included in my selected bibliography which i didn't feel 
good without going without because there are so many people that I need to give credit to. Of course, it's selected, so I can't include everything, but these are some of the works that I found especially helpful. When you get to the back of the book, of course, you can scroll through these. I'd make a special note referencing the work of Charles Chiniqui, the former Roman Catholic priest who, is, who lived in the 1800s in Quebec, as well as Sister Charlotte Wells. Both of these individuals' testimonies played a significant role in the creation of some of the characters and the plot line, and also my dad's testimony. Of course, there are many testimonies of individuals, past and present, who have um, had an influential role in just um, inspiring the story. If anyone wants a hardcover, you better hurry up because we haven't sold any soft covers yet and we only have 150, just a little over 150 hardcovers. So you better stick your order in soon if you want hardcover. Eventually, these books will be available on online platforms and also in ebook format on Barnes and Noble, Amazon, and um, different online platforms. So you can keep your eyes out for that. But if you want to get your copy and support our family business, fourseasonsnorth.com, and if you want an autographed copy, please order from fourseasonsnorth.com. And for any of those of you who are not aware, I keep a writing blog called atthebrooksbend.ca. On that blog, you will find poetry, short stories, book reviews. And if you would like a sneak peek into the book, make sure you head on over there because I'll be posting a preview section of the book to whet your interest. <laughs> Links are all provided below. Kate Fletcher can never forget that she is the orphan child of an adulterous woman. It is the reason she lives at the Magdalene Asylum. Her fate as a stigmatized member of society is sealed, and it is her duty to atone for her mother's sin by binding herself irrevocably to the Roman Catholic Church as a sister of mercy. Union Sergeant John Dallington will not allow distant regrets to follow him. He is a Protestant, and a past littered with painful secrets can neither threaten his identity in the doctrines of Reformed theology, nor shake the confidence inherited through his patriarchal role as father to his two children, until he meets Sister Kate. Set against the backdrop of the 19th century Irish immigration movement and the American Civil War, this fascinating story follows the lives of Kate and John as they collide amidst the turmoil and treachery of a war-torn Washington, D.C., where they both are forced to grapple with questions about their pasts, their choices, and the will of God. The rebellious but furiously honest Colette Clayton, the tobacco-chewing, illiterate private Jack Gunderson, the confirmed bachelor and pragmatic skeptic Dr. Robert Hall, and the fiery Scottish midwife Ellen Kelly are just a few of the unforgettable secondary characters who play into the intriguing subplots of this rich piece of historical fiction. Exploring themes of innocence and betrayal, slavery and free will, and the conflict between the search for romantic fulfillment and the quest to find peace with God and oneself through these dark gates is a compelling novel about a young woman's journey and one man's battle through the labyrinths of religious skepticism and self-deception toward ultimate self-realization and the knowledge of what it means to be truly free. I hope you order your copy of Through These Dark Gates hardcover or softcover. If you order through Four Seasons North, you'll get an autographed copy. Thank you so much for your support and head over to fourseasonsnorth.com and grab your copy today. See you later.
Nope, I bought the first one I touched on. Are you serious? Yeah. Can I see that one? This is the one. Mine. Yeah, no, you're, you're not videoing. Oh, you're gonna buy it. Oh, okay. See? And it says, Oh, Mr. Mine. B you must have got mine. Oh, okay. ah, Mr. B! <laughs> how dare he! Hey. I had one in here. It had a little mark on the cover. Can you sign it, Brooke? Yes, you're I will. You're taking all your Zevia away. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay, I'll have to get the exact. It's just a little bit over. Oh. Oh yeah, that looked good. Oh. Lick it again, just with your tongue instead of your finger. Oh yeah. <laughs> Do you want to purchase through these dark gates? If I read it to you, you would be delighted, <laughs> wouldn't you? Your voice is my favorite voice in the whole wide world. I guess I'll autograph it right here. Yeah. Do you want it right here, Brie? Yeah. Where would you like the right across? So um, it's very, uh, it's going to keep you maybe guessing. Uh, I don't really think I'm doing a very good job. You're not that. doing a very good job. <laughs> Centers around. Um, I'm going to start over. Turmoil and treachery of a war torn, of a war torn, um, and the. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. So your copy is right now Canadian, Canadian price currently. The, okay, go faster. Okay. I could almost raise the price, but. So order your copy today. $32 Canadian for hardcover, $22 Canadian for softcover, plus your shipping. If you order one of these or multiple books, the shipping is the same. Um, or just order more books to make up for the high shipping. <laughs> it's the best that we can do. So I have a blog called, no, I didn't say that very good. Can you not get too close to my face? Kind of nicer, right. a bit more space. If you, how should I? Uh, of course, drop a line in our comments below on fourseasonsnorth.com or on at the Brooks Bend or on our YouTube channels. It's, or all three. Or all three or on our website. It's always a treat to hear from you guys and we just so appreciate your support. So thank you so much. Thank you for watching the video and um, go grab your copy today. Yeah. And, and